I'm in Allegheny County in North Carolina, headed to the 40-room High Meadow Zoo. This hotel and restaurant is owned by Doreen and husband Zanka. He runs the restaurant, she manages the hotel. They've been scraping by for the past 11 years. But they need to turn this business around quick before it closes its doors. Anthony! Anthony, wait! Crazy lady. Now what happened? No, nothing happened. Don't make me run after you. So I spoke with the AMC liquidators folks. Okay, you got furniture you like? Yeah, lots of nice stuff on their website, right. and they're going to be here any minute. Now? Yes, like any minute. Okay, meet me in the parking lot. I'm going to get the owners. All right. Follow me. Okay. I'm coming. Leslie, this is Doreen and Zanko. Hi, nice to meet you both. Leslie is the designer that's working on your project. Okay. I want you to see something that we've never done before on Hotel Impossible. It's big. Really big. I have a surprise for him. It's Saturday. We don't get deliveries on Saturday. Hey, Mike. Hello, Anthony. How, How are, are you, you, buddy? Good to see you. He's AMC Liquidators. And has anyone asked you for a favor like this before? Not like this. This is a special one, just for you. So I want to show you something. In here is 40 rooms of furniture. Wow. We have artwork, headboards, chairs. We have everything for your rooms. 40 rooms. The entire hotel has furniture. Thank you. At the bottom of my heart. You're welcome. Why are you crying, Doreen? Because they're happy tears. That's why. This is a big, big step. We're getting you up to speed really quickly. So I'm gonna let them unload this because we got a lot of work to do. Oh my gosh. Wow, unbelievable. It's not the Nothing same Nothing the room. same. This room looks clean and fresh and feels good. You see the furniture from AMC yeah. Liquidators? I love it. The High Meadows Inn was closed when I got here. The hotel owners thought it was open, but it was closed. When my friend Mike from AMC Liquidators provided the hotel with 40 rooms of furniture, I saw the look on the faces of the owners that was priceless. That's what the show's about, and that's why I love helping small businesses, because they never would have been able to afford that furniture on their own.